Presenting our nation's covers tonight is the Naval Submarine based King's Bay Honor Guard and the Jacksonville Air Civil Air Patrol. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise and kindly remove your hats to the scene of our national anthem by Tom Norton. Oh, see, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hail at the twilight's last beam, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the pale. So gallantly sweet, and the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night that a flag was still there. Oh, say.
decorated Monster Jam World Final Struck from Paxton, Illinois. It's the Elliot and Max D.
Texas qualifier, Adam Anderson and Gray Digger. Now coming up in just a couple of minutes, it will be the Monster Jam Wheelie Competition. So fans, go ahead and get your smartphones and devices out and go to www.judgeszone.com to participate in the fan score after each competitor's run is complete. Once again, go to www.judgeszone.com, enter the code JAX, and you're all set. Fans, as you can see on the media board, we are going to have our top eight here from Circle K Monster Jam Qualifying. Let's take a look right now at the media board. As you can see, fastest qualifier, Adam Anderson and Grady with a 19.400. Monster Energy and Tom LeDoux with a 19.424. The third spot goes to Jenny Creek and Bounty Hunter. And then Neil and Max D, who has made two Monster Jam Racing Finals on the FS1 West Championship Series, round out the fourth spot. Now the top four seeds in America's Best Monster Jam Racing will get to choose the lane choice as they were the fastest four as they go into round number one of America's Best Monster Jam Racing. Racing B in the five spot, El Toro Loco in the sixth spot. Who is going to be their last two in America's Best Monster Jam Racing? Scarlett Brandon and Don Creed in the seventh spot and then closing it out in the eighth spot. Cole Stevens and FS1 Cletus. Now the remaining six will go directly to our Budweiser Monster Jam Weekly Competition.